I've always admired the um, sectioned machinery which uh, you see in museums and like places. Um, so I decided to uh, make a couple of my own from uh, Steam Toys. Uh, I actually made two. There's, this one here is uh, the engine sub-assembly from a Walesco D16 and this one is uh, a Mamad SE3. The Walesco unit um, I bought as a uh, as a part engine. It never was complete. Um, it actually came with a few other bits and pieces, but the only um, anything like complete and working part was the, the engine sub assembly. So I uh, did away with all the other bits and, and kept the uh, the unit um, with the initial intention of perhaps uh, getting hold of the rest of the engine, uh, boiler and so on, and uh, completing it and restoring it as a complete steam engine. But um, then I uh, later acquired a complete uh, D16, so um, there was no longer any need to uh, restore this one. And uh, so I had the idea of uh, sectioning it. Um, this was the first one I did uh, and I limited my sectioning to just the, the cylinder. Um, I cut it away with, uh, with it's starting off with hacksaw and then a uh, file and finally finishing off with emery cloth. The rest of the engine, the conrods, valve gear, valve rods, flywheel, crankshaft and so on, are unsectioned. And if you Turn the flywheel by hand. You can see the piston and valve gear working. And you can see that the Willasco valve gear is not quite a piston valve in the true sense of the word and it's not really a traditional slide valve either because it is cylindrical but the working is virtually the same as a slide valve see if you reverse it it takes half a revolution before the valve gear catches up due to the slip eccentric
I fitted a Meccano sprocket onto the end of the shaft so that it can be powered by an electric motor or something like that if so desired but uh, I don't have a suitable setup for that.